Hey everybody, this is Tim Whittemore, uh, your local expert and enthusiastic professional. We're just here uh, previewing some of the beach accesses here that you're going to find there on Okaloosa Island here in the Fort Walton Beach area. So we're just going to preview some things and some cool little amenities that you'll see and uh, we'll kind of walk you through uh, the, how these things go. <laughs> Thing to notice while you're out here and trying to park at the beach if some of these accesses are filled make sure you don't park on the street like this guy did well that might be mine if you don't move it soon definitely the uh, local PD will help you uh, get that thing towed out of here <music> to note while you're uh, going to head out to the beach here is as you can see up here there are some rules that you should probably abide by. Some of the things like no fires, no glass, no alcohol, no animals that aren't service animals, and of course no disorderly conduct. Well let's keep it peaceful here. Now a couple things also that you can anticipate when coming to a lot of these beach accesses is that you're going to see that there are some things that you can use. Now we do have water fountains here almost at every single one. Uh, there are bathrooms with male and female and most of the time you're going to find some showers as well as a couple of shaded picnic areas if you so choose. Some other things to know while you're going out to the beach, as you can see, it does have a composite here for, for the wood while you're walking out here. It does get super hot, so make sure that you got your sandals on or you're gonna have some burnt feet. <laughs> If you're thinking about getting married on the beach and that was always something you wanted to do out here, just make sure you have to do some coordination. everybody that's our preview of the public access beaches that we have here on Okaloosa Island off of Santa Rosa Boulevard here uh, we saw access 1 through 7 today uh, also note uh, that there are some other accesses on the island that you can go to that don't necessarily have facilities or a parking lot uh, but they are kind of intermixed between the two just in case you need a quick drop off Things also to note, make sure of course not to be parking on the beach outside the designated parking areas. Uh, don't park in the condos either, they don't like it and they'll probably tow you. Same thing on the street, uh, the local law enforcement doesn't like it, they'll probably tow you as well. 
just be safe have a great time out there and if you have any additional questions please do uh, feel free to get a hold of me and of course if you like this if you thought this was useful please do like or share with somebody that you think would get a good benefit from this anyways i'll see you next time down here in fort walton beach Thank you.